He has been the center of conversation today after announcing the largest bonus allotment in corporate Kenya. With many in awe of those that work for him, 37-year-old Centum Investment CEO James Moria clarifies the one billion bonus payout is a concerted effort over the last six years. At Centum, we really de-emphasize the salary and we focus more on what is going to be your invoiceable value, what is going to be the tangible value of your being here for one year, two years, what are you bringing onto the table? And being fair about it, when you bring something onto the table that is tangible, that is auditable, you're then going to be rewarded, you're going to get a share of that value. James has been in the helm of leadership of Centum Investment for the last seven years and has seen the company grow in leaps and bounds, expanding into new territories including Mauritius and Nigeria. His mantra, the highest return on capital and time, is investment in yourself. So how has he been able to instill the same in his workforce? Change the focus from being takers, because we have a zero-sum mentality amongst many people, who think for me to do well, somebody else must do badly, and focus on giving themselves so that we can create something, and at the end of the day, getting a slice of that. And it's also about patience. Speaking about the one billion shilling that was reported in the newspapers, this is an amount that will be paid out over three years. And it will be paid over time, dependent on how we perform in the future. So you must be able to, we must be able to sustain that value if that value comes down, then the amount will not be paid. There are tranches that will not, will not vest. It's also a function of you remaining in the employee of the company. So if you leave the company, then you will not get the money. With Kenya positioning itself as a hub of international investment, Centum Investment has invested in various projects, including the multi-billion Two Rivers development that is tipped to be the largest shopping mall within sub-Saharan Africa outside of South Africa. And James has even bigger dreams for the investment firm going forward. I see no reason why we cannot be one of the top three most valuable companies on the NSC. I see no reason why we are not going to be a significant player across a range of sectors. We are creating what does not exist. And by creating what does not exist, you then create exceptional value because what does not exist has a lot of value to a lot of people. And that's a business. We are fortunate to be in the business of, of, of creation. James has attracted accolades in his stint at Centum Investment, including the All Africa Business Leader Awards Abler, having bagged Africa Young Business Leader of the Year in 2011 and Business Leader of the Year 2015, which he received last night. The 37-year-old CEO has some words of advice for his peers. Success is teamwork. You need to engage everybody. You need to engage the board. Here we have a very engaged board. We have a very engaged team. It's not about the CEO. It's about engaging everybody and everybody being part of that, of that process. The numbers are made by the people, not the other way around. Is people produce numbers and human beings are capable of infinite capacity. Focus on, on enhancing the leadership of your team. That is a constraint to any business. Gladys Gashanja, NTV.